a prayer commemorating the 20th anniversary of 9-11. It was 20 years ago this weekend that planes crashed into the Twin Towers of New York City, as well as the Pentagon, and one plane was forcibly crashed in a field in Pennsylvania. I invite you to join me in a moment of reflection and remembrance and prayer. Pray with me. Lord God, we remember the stockbrokers and office workers, maintenance workers, bystanders, window washers, and all who work together so valiantly to help each other. We remember their great courage. We recall the firefighters who rushed in as other people were racing out. And we remember this, their selfless service. We remember the police officers who stood to protect and defend the people and performed their duties until the towers came crashing down upon them. And we remember their selfless sacrifice. We recall the thousands of men and women, young and old, single and married, American born and foreign born, who did not escape the buildings. We mourn the loss of human life. And we recall citizens who rushed to help and did all they could to help. We remember and give thanks for the dutiful commitment of those in distress. And we remember when people stood in line at the nation's blood banks to make living donations from their very bodies. And we are thankful for those who live on to pass life and love on to others. We remember the millions of Americans who gave so generously of their life and labor to endow funds to help the survivors and their families recover from their losses. And we are thankful for the generosity. We remember with deep and personal identification. We remember the affliction of our brothers and sisters and mark their pain as our own. Lord God, we also remember the words of the prophet Isaiah, who longed for the day when swords would be turned into plowshares and spears into pruning hooks, when the lion would lie down with the lamb, and when a child could play over the nest of the adder. And we remember the vision of John on the island of Patmos, who saw the day when God would wipe away every tear and death would be no more. God of the ages, before your eyes all the empires rise and fall, and yet you are changeless. Be near us in this age of terror and in those moments of remembrance. Uphold those who work and watch and wait and weep and love. By your spirit, give rise in us to broad sympathy for all the peoples of your earth. Strengthen us to comfort those who mourn and work in large ways and small for those things that make for peace. Bless the people and leaders of this nation and all the nations so that warfare, like slavery before it, may become only a historic memory. We pray all of these things in the prayers of our hearts, in the name of the Prince of Peace, Jesus Christ. Amen.